Denzel Washington, acclaimed actor and Hollywood icon, is not just a singular figure in the spotlight. Behind the scenes, his family boasts a rich tapestry of diversity and success, each member carving their own unique path in the world, from his wife, Pauletta Washington, to their children, and even their fascinating car collection and luxurious home. The Washington family story is one of intrigue, achievement, and undeniable glamour. Pauletta Washington, the elegant and poised matriarch of the family, stands as a pillar of strength and support alongside her legendary husband. Despite her preference to remain out of the limelight, Pauletta's influence on Denzel's life and career is unmistakable. Her unwavering love and guidance shaping their family's journey through fame and fortune. Their daughter, whose identity as a member of the LGBTQ plus community adds another layer of complexity to their narrative, embodies courage and authenticity. Her story of self-discovery and acceptance within the Washington dynasty serves as a beacon of hope and inspiration to countless others. Denzel Washington, Born on December 28, 1954, in Mount Vernon, New York, is one of Hollywood's most celebrated actors. Known for his powerful performances and commanding presence on screen, however, before he became a household name, Washington's early life and background shaped the foundation of his remarkable career. Washington was born to Lennis Lynn Washington, a beauty parlor owner and Denzel Hayes Washington Sr., a Pentecostal minister and employee at a local water department. Growing up in Mount Vernon, a suburb just north of New York City, Denzel was exposed to a diverse community that would later influence his worldview and acting versatility. From a young age, Washington displayed a natural talent for performance, participating in school plays and honing his craft in local theater productions. Despite his passion for acting, he initially pursued a career in journalism, attending Fordham University in the Bronx, where he studied journalism and played basketball on a scholarship. However, his love for the stage ultimately prevailed, and he later transferred to the renowned acting program at the Lincoln Center campus of Fordham. After graduating from Fordham University with a Bachelor of Arts degree in Drama and Journalism, Washington embarked on his acting career, determined to make a name for himself in the competitive world of entertainment. He honed his skills further at the American Conservatory Theater in San Francisco before making his professional stage debut in the 1970s. Washington's breakthrough came in the 1980s when he landed notable roles in both film and television, earning critical acclaim for his performances in projects like A Soldier's Story, 1984, and the television movie The George McKenna Story, 1986. However, it was his portrayal of South African anti-apartheid activist Steve Biko in the 1980 film Cry Freedom that garnered widespread recognition and earned him his first Academy Award nomination for Best Supporting Actor. Throughout the 1990s and beyond, Washington solidified his status as one of Hollywood's leading men, delivering unforgettable performances in a diverse range of films, from historical dramas like Malcolm X, 1992, to action-packed thrillers like Training Day, 2001 for which he won his first Academy Award for Best Actor. Washington's versatility and commanding presence on screen solidified his status as one of Hollywood's leading men. His ability to inhabit complex characters with depth and authenticity endeared him to audiences and critics alike, earning him numerous awards and accolades throughout his career. Beyond his work in front of the camera, Washington has also proven himself as a talented director and producer with films like Antoine Fisher and Fences, showcasing his storytelling prowess and artistic vision. Denzel Washington, 
one of the most versatile and acclaimed actors in Hollywood, has portrayed a wide range of memorable characters throughout his illustrious career. From intense dramas to action-packed thrillers and everything in between, Washington's talent and charisma have left an undeniable mark on cinema. Here are just a few of his most iconic roles. Malcolm X In Spike Lee's biographical epic Malcolm X 1992, Washington delivered a powerhouse performance as the influential civil rights leader, capturing the complexity and passion of the iconic figure. Training Day Washington won his second Academy Award for Best Actor for his role as corrupt detective Alonzo Harris in Training Day, 2001, a gritty crime thriller directed by Antoine Fuqua. Glory Washington earned critical acclaim and his first Academy Award nomination for his portrayal of Private Trip in Glory, 1989 a historical drama about the first African-American regiment in the Civil War. Fences Washington starred and directed in the film adaptation of August Wilson's Pulitzer Prize-winning play Fences, 2016, delivering a powerhouse performance as Troy Maxson, a former baseball player struggling with race relations and family dynamics in 1950s Pittsburgh. The Hurricane in The Hurricane 1999, Washington portrayed Reuben Hurricane Carter, a boxer wrongfully convicted of murder, earning widespread praise for his compelling portrayal of the real-life figure. Remember the Titans Washington charmed audiences as Coach Herman Boone in Remember the Titans 2000, a feel-good sports drama based on the true story of a racially integrated high school football team in the 1970s. Philadelphia Washington starred alongside Tom Hanks in Philadelphia 1993, a groundbreaking drama about a lawyer who takes on a discrimination case involving a gay man with AIDS, showcasing his versatility in tackling complex social issues. The Equalizer Washington brought his trademark intensity to the role of Robert McCall in The Equalizer 2014 and its sequel, playing a former black ops operative who seeks justice for the oppressed and downtrodden. Man on Fire In Man on Fire 2004, Washington portrayed John Creasy, a disillusioned ex-CIA operative who seeks redemption by protecting a young girl in Mexico City, delivering a memorable performance in the action-packed thriller. Flight Washington received critical acclaim for his portrayal of troubled airline pilot Whip Whitaker in Flight 2012, showcasing his ability to imbue flawed characters with depth and humanity. He has also maintained a strong and enduring relationship off-screen. He has been married to Pauletta Pearson since June 25, 1983, and their marriage has become one of Hollywood's most enduring unions. Pauletta Pearson, an accomplished actress and singer in her own right, first met Denzel when they were both working on the set of the television film Wilma in 1977. Despite initial complications, including Denzel's reluctance to commit to a serious relationship, the couple eventually fell deeply in love. Their relationship has weathered the storms of fame and fortune, with Denzel often crediting Pauletta for being his rock and source of support throughout his career. In interviews, he has spoken fondly of their partnership, emphasizing the importance of communication, trust, and mutual respect in, man in maintaining a successful marriage. Together, Denzel and Pauletta have four children, John David, Katia, and twins Olivia and Malcolm. Their family life has remained relatively private, with Denzel and Pauletta prioritizing their children's privacy and well-being. Despite the challenges of balancing their demanding careers with family life, Denzel and Pauletta have managed to keep their love alive and thriving for over four decades. Their enduring bond 
serves as a shining example of love, commitment, and partnership in the often tumultuous world of Hollywood. Here's everything to know about Denzel Washington's children. John David Washington, 39. Denzel and Pauletta's eldest son, John David Washington, was born on July 28, 1984, in Los Angeles. He attended Campbell Hall School in L.A., where he was on the basketball, football, and track teams. After he graduated from high school in 2002, he attended Atlanta's Morehouse College, where he played football as a running back and graduated in 2006. After college, John David had a brief career as a professional football player. He signed with the St. Louis Rams during the 2006-2007 season before playing for Germany's Rain Fire during the 2007 offseason. In 2009, he was drafted in the United Football League's California Redwoods, where he played until 2012, when the league shut down. Katia Washington, 37. Denzel and Pauletta's second child, daughter Katia Washington, was born on November 27, 1986, in L.A. Katia studied at Yale University, where she graduated in 2010. Though Katia keeps her personal life private, she has followed the career path of many other members of the Washington family and works behind the scenes as a producer for Braun Studios. In her career, she has worked as a producer on Fences, Malcolm and Marie, Breaking, and Sharpstick. The personal life of Katia Washington, exploring the speculations and inquiries surrounding her sexual orientation as a private individual, Katia Washington, the daughter of esteemed actor Denzel Washington, has largely kept her personal life away from the public eye. In 2017, when the first allegations regarding the 37-year-old's sexual orientation began to circulate, they alleged that she was in a romantic relationship with a woman named Colleen. They were reportedly observed in public endorsing LGBTQ plus rights collectively. It is essential to note, however, that these rumors remain unconfirmed and neither Katia nor Colleen have affirmed or addressed any romantic involvement in an official capacity. Katia's dedication to maintaining the privacy of her private life is an additionally underscored by her choice to retain a private Instagram account, despite having a prominent follower in the form of Zendaya. In an era where social media frequently provides insight into the private lives of public figures, Katia opts to obscure this aspect of her life, permitting only brief glimpses into her professional pursuits. As long as concrete information is lacking, the allegations that have circulated regarding Katia Washington's romantic life remain merely rumors. In her capacity as the progeny of a prominent figure in Hollywood, she seems to value her personal space highly, requiring both admirers and inquisitive individuals to adhere to the restrictions she establishes. Malcolm Washington, 32. Malcolm Washington and his twin sister, Olivia, were born on April 10, 1991 in L.A. He attended the Windward School, where he lettered four years in basketball. He also received several accolades as a high school athlete, including first-team All-League, Academic All-American and 2009 Windward Winter Classic Tournament MPV, all while remaining on the honor roll. After high school, he attended the University of Pennsylvania, where he studied film and played for the university's basketball team during the 2009-2010 season. One of his former teammates, Zach Rosen, called Malcolm Pesky to the Daily Pennsylvania in November 2009. He brings energy, Rosen added, and I think he knows that that's his role, the energy guy, bringing a lot of spunk. Olivia Washington, 32. Like her twin brother Malcolm, Olivia Washington was born in L.A. on April 10, 1991. After high school, Olivia studied at New York University's 
Tech School of Arts and graduated in 2013 with a bachelor's degree in drama. Much like her siblings and her parents, Olivia has pursued a career in the entertainment industry as an actress. In May 2015, she told New York Amsterdam News that she grew up with an artistic spirit and was often dancing or playing the piano. But it wasn't until she was a junior in high school that she began working with family friend Latanya Richardson Dak Jackson and realized she wanted to focus on acting. Denzel Washington's net worth in 2024 is estimated at a full $300 million. Washington reportedly pocketed $20 million for The Equalizer in 2015. The film grossed more than $192 million worldwide and a $55 million budget. Washington didn't just star in the film, he was also credited as a producer on the project, which was successful enough to get a sequel. Training Day earned Washington his second acting Oscar, as well as a $12 million paycheck. The Equalizer 2 was Washington's first ever sequel, and it was a successful outing, grossing $190 million worldwide on a $60 million budget. His exact salary hasn't been reported, but we can assume it was at least around the same $20 million he earned for the first Equalizer installment. Washington reportedly made $20 million in 2004's Man on Fire. The film made $130.8 million on a $70 million budget and grew a cult following. Washington reportedly earns on average of $20 million per movie up front. He may also get back end bonuses based on box office performance. Denzel Washington, the legendary actor renowned for his commanding presence on screen, resides in a magnificent $60 million mansion that epitomizes luxury and sophistication. Nestled in the exclusive neighborhoods of Beverly Hills, Washington's sprawling estate boasts panoramic views of the surrounding hillsides and the glittering lights of Los Angeles below. With its palatial proportions and meticulously landscaped grounds, the mansion executes timeless elegance and opulence at every turn. From its grand foyer adorned with marble floors to its state-of-the-art amenities, including a private theater, expansive pool, and lush gardens, Washington's residence serves as a serene sanctuary befitting his stature in the entertainment industry. Amidst the hustle and bustle of Hollywood, Washington's lavish mansion stands as a testament to his success and enduring legacy in the world of film. Denzel Washington owns a decent car collection. Although not as massive and expensive as celebrities like Tom Cruise, Rowan Atkinson, and Dwayne Johnson, he has an SUV, a luxury sedan, and high-performance coupes among his possessions. Chrysler 300. According to reports, Denzel Washington also owns a black Chrysler 300. In 2023, model of this premium sedan cost $37,640 at first. Demanding on the trim grade and the engine, the price can jump up to $45,350,000. Having said that, for now, Chrysler has added a 2023 300C model to the lineup. The base 3.6 liter V6 engine produces 292 horsepower and 260 pounds per foot of torque. With the 300S model specifications, the same engine is able to put out 300 horsepower and 264 pound foot of torque. The Chrysler 300 is a full-size sedan that competes with the Toyota Avalon and Dodge Charger and the Volkswagen Arteon. Land Rover, Range Rover. Denzel Washington has been spotted quite often in the Land Rover Range Rover SUV. However, which model year Dental owns is still unclear. The latest 2023 Range Rover has a base price of $104,500, 
Additionally, the Range Rover offers multiple powertrains across multiple trims, including a plug-in hybrid system. The 3.0-liter turbocharged inline six is a standard engine. It churns out 395 horsepower and 406 pound foot of torque. For more power, a 553 horsepower 4.4 liter twin turbo V8 engine is also available. That said, the 2023 Land Rover Range Rover comes with several standard driving aids and creature comforts. Aston Martin DBS Denzel not only likes to get pampered in the likes of a Rolls Royce Phantom, but he also prefers the adrenaline rush given by formidable sports cars such as the Aston Martin DBS. In 2012, Aston Martin DBS was available in a coupe and cost $280,576,000. Equipped with a monstrous V12 powertrain, the 2012 DBS Coupe can sprint from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 4.3 seconds, and it has a top speed of 191 miles per hour. 1997 Porsche 911 Turbo The 1997 Porsche 911 Turbo, a 993 era 911 car that remains a hot topic among car enthusiasts. This year, Denzel Washington decided to make more space in his garage by putting the 1997 Porsche Beauty with just over 18,000 miles up for auction on Brig a Trailer. The black colored 993 generation 911 Turbo received the final bid of $405,993,000. The 1997 911 Turbo had 18 inch wheels a limited slip rear differential, a power sunroof, leather front streets with power adjustability, a Nokia DSP audio system, and more. There are several other cars that Denzel Washington drove throughout his career. For example, the training day car that he drove in the film was a black 1979 Chevrolet Monte Carlo, becoming an iconic symbol of his character's corrupt journey in the movie. We expect to see many more additions to Denzel Washington's car collection in the future.